So rally-specific ghosting, uh, how you would mirror literally rallies going on. Um, again, w with timings, we record timings. We, we're always looking at this from the TV aspect of the game. You're looking at around about 10 seconds, sometimes 20 seconds if a player's being a bit cheeky, delaying in between rallies. So you're looking at a 10 to 20 second rest, and then rally lengths average, you're looking probably 30, 30 seconds work to 40 seconds. So for instance, if you were doing kind of 30 seconds ghosting very, very fast, patterned or unpatterned, there's a theme here where for each element of ghosting, you can do unpatterned or patterned, depending on what you're wanting to do, and, and variety as well. You know, variety is the spice of life, as they say. But um, so from that aspect, I would say that uh, if you wanted to get very, very specific, fast rally explosive, you're looking at kind of 10 seconds, 20 seconds work. So 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds work. And then you can move up to 30 seconds with possibly 15 seconds uh, rest in between. And then 40 seconds work with 20 seconds rest. And you can repeat, you can do a huge amount of sets of this, obviously. You could do... If you wanted to, you, if you wanted to really simulate that, that element of, of playing the game, then you could do 10 sets to kind of mirror um, 11 scoring at the pro level with two minutes rest in between. So 10 sets, two minutes rest, repeat that three times. Uh, again, you have to tailor this for your level and for your fitness as well. I mean, if you're literally stumbling around the court after doing 10 sets, then that's enough. You know, you want quality over quantity, otherwise you will injure yourself. And that's obviously something that you do not want to be doing. So, you know, you need to approach this with an open mind and be kind to yourself. You want to get the most out of your training sessions, okay? But you don't want to kill yourself off so that you actually get injured or you don't actually don't want to be training. It's got to be fun as well.